with the cold and flu season kicking into high gear, you can only protect yourself so much from getting sick. But if you believe in natural remedies, a legal Asian mushroom claims to be more powerful than most products on the market. Tonight's Evans' Tom Haynes shows us why mushroom magic is becoming more popular than ever. Red, white, brown. There are 38,000 different kinds of mushrooms, some toxic enough to kill. Others almost contain mystical powers. In Chinese medicine in Japan, they highly regard the med medicinal mushrooms. Among the most potent, a rare red mushroom known as rishi. In Asian culture, it's considered a magical mushroom with the ability to cure almost any illness. Everyone and anyone can benefit at any given age. It can strengthen the whole body. Oh, I just tried it. I couldn't believe it. Bella Manchin started using red mushroom products after hearing about them through a friend. I use the coffee, I use the tea, I use the mocha, I use the hot chocolate. And since she started seven months ago, she's noticed a change. My energy level is unbelievable. Oh, I feel strong. My body really feels strong. I just feel strong. And my mind is very, very focused and I'm very clear. You can now find the mushroom herb in coffees, teas, or oatmeal. They're also made in soaps, toothpaste, and lotions. Or for an easy fix, you can just take a reishi pill. In numerous studies, reishi's proven to tame allergies, high blood pressure, heart disease, and help fight inflammation. It clarifies, builds, strengthens the immune system, uh, gives a lot of energy. You can focus, concentrate much better. Coffee has been life changing. Bella's never been better. Since making the switch, she doesn't taste the difference, she feels the difference. You feel wonderful, you have energy. That's the feeling I have most of the time. Very positive attitude, very up, very upbeat. Rishi pills are available at most natural food stores. You can buy coffees and other products online. And as always, consult your doctor or a licensed nutritionist before starting any supplemental program. In the Newsplex, Tom Haynes, 7 News.